Hello everyone and welcome back to the Lone Mechanist RimWorld the Lone Mechanist series. There we go. I'm your host, Eli the Fatigued. I might think up another idol. It might be the next series though. Anyway, last episode we got to working on expanding our ship. Oops, he's taking a bath. Expanding our ship and starting to put down weapon hardpoints, which is really nice. And now we're out of steel. It's fine. Large hard points. And then, yeah, I think I'm going to use a lot of lasers because I have a lot of power. That's short range. Does this require power? Yeah, I think these, okay, yeah, I think these technically require power. This requires uranium. <laughs> Hey. I don't think. Oh, that would have worked too. Yeah, that's fine. This this just looks nicer to me. Ooh, wait, hold on. I just realized. I'm gonna do the. Yeah, that's right. Oh, that's oh, that's unfortunate. But it's fine. Okay, so if we're going to do it that way, then we can just put another large over here by the looks of it. It's going to be off-centered. OCD. It's fine. So... I forget... I think these are like the engines in that they'll technically keep the ship atmosphere in. A new hole in your hole, yeah. Base damage by 25%, but also increases power consumption heat generated by the same percentage. There we go. It was bugged out there. Thought it was out of steel, but apparently not. I don't understand what happened there. It's fine. Are we out of advanced components as well? Is that part of the issue? No, it doesn't seem like it. All right, well. I usually like it like something like like this. It is a massive, massive, like, it can, like, completely wreck your... So, I think for now, I think that should be fine.
And we can change it up later if we want. So we're, we're going to need a lot more steel. A lot more steel. We also need to make advanced components, I think. Uh, looks like we're fine on advanced components. We're just lacking normal steel. And we have a ton of normal components. We have a ton of advanced components. Yeah, so we're, we're just normal steel at this point. Where is our steel? It might not be showing up because we're using it all. Yeah, I think that's the case. All right, that's fine. So we need another steel shipment. All right. Just all the steel. All the plastic steel as well. All the uranium. These are resources we need. Uh, golden steel, gold and silver can stay, I think. I think we're fine on gold up there. I think we could use a lot more plastic steel and definitely steel, and then uranium's just good to have extra of up there. What? Between transfer pods and 7,000 steel. You're lying to me. <laughs> Is it because of... I think it's because of where I placed it. That's blocking it or something? Okay. All the steel, all the uranium, all the plasteel. I think that was it. Let's do, maybe it's because I'm trying to use all of it and it's, yeah, okay, I'm trying to use all of it and some of it is in use by someone else. Something like that, probably. That's fine. There we go. Yeah, I think that's what was going on. Pro Slayer. What a terrible... <laughs> I slay crows! I am the best! What the heck kind of name is that? Uh, I'm sorry. If anyone actually uses the name, the, the moniker, or, like, username Crow Slayer, I apologize. In terms of RimWorld, though, it's a little silly. This guy slays crows. Well, most everyone here has slain many alien invasions. You're not slaying crows, isn't that impressive, little colonist? Uh, I don't know, man. I'm whatever. It's fine. Oh, man. Maybe I should get these guys up so they can help haul steel, but it's fine. Rather than continue to sleep, so that there's no, so that there's less lag. Only time I, I think I'll wake up those kind of droids is when we're under attack or something. I, I'm keeping the destroyers awake because I think they move faster than normal battle droids. Okay, it's ready to launch. We are slowly but surely making progress.
Yeah, if you've got nothing else to do, mine steel. We could always use more steel. Liter literally, legitimately, steel is so important. Not even just in this kind of game, but especially in this kind of game where you're building a ship and need tons of steel. And I think I could use unpowered ship hulls, and that would technically be cheaper. Yeah, I think it's technically cheaper. 16 steel, 4 plasteel, 1 component. Versus... Yeah, it's like a couple of stuff cheaper, but... At the same time, I'd rather make sure that power can go smoothly throughout my entire ship. Without having to build conduits, which would just be additional steel anyway. So... Actually, technically cheaper to build the power uh, walls. Alright, haul urgently. These and thank. Oh, it's a little warm in here. I think it's getting up to 75 and we have the window open in the south. That's probably why. Sorry, we're stretching there, guys. Apologies. Alright, here we go. Ah, it's beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so we're going to have the point defense. Okay, so you four are going to be point defense. And then, mm, maybe not all four, I don't know. We'll keep them on point defense for our first battle. And then, if it wasn't that much of a worry, then maybe I'll take a couple off. We'll see. Ah, oh, so nice. Bet we're already out of steel, though, right? No, we still got 3,000. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. Alright. Okay. Large rail turn. There we go. And then... I guess a couple more laser turrets, right? I don't know. Oh, it's a beautiful thing. Wait, is that not technically connected to power? Are you serious? Are you serious? So I think I need to do something, yeah, something along these lines. There we go. There we go. And then I guess do some small plasma turrets here. How is this a vacuum? It's unroofed somewhere. Hmm. I don't know why this is unroofed. Flamingo leather patched shirt. Okay. Maybe I'll modify things a bit. I don't know. See if that fixes it. Yep, that's what it was. That's what it was. So I probably need to roof this thingy in. Hmm. 
Maybe? A? Maybe? No. Maybe it's one of the walls. Oh, there it is. No? No. Why? Why is it saying it's unroofed? I, I legitimately do not know. It was five, and now it's down to one. I mean, maybe just try this. I, I don't know. We're out of plasteel. And then... Or I was going to put large laser turrets. I remember having heat sink issues with this kind of setup. But it's fine. It's going to be fine. Maybe it's waiting for that. That, that. that might be what it is. Waiting for that and then building a roof above it? What are you doing? Build a roof. Oh. Oh. I don't know. Well, I don't know why it's saying unroofed. All right, then remove roof there. Let's see if that makes it upset. What? What? Why? I guess because he technically can't go in there. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Oh my gosh! Someone just prioritize removing the roof, please. an area that's no path right there. Do I need to... Alright, let's uninstall this. And then... Build roof here. And then reinstall this. No. That didn't fix it. I'm I'm so confused as to what is causing this. I'm trying to right click in this area. See if there's just somewhere that's really not yet. Like over here or something. Hmm. I don't, I don't know. It's interesting. I mean, I'm fine ultimately, ultimately with it being unroofed, but I just... Alright, let's send this thing back down. It's been here long enough. And we are out of steel again. Nice. Ooh. Oh. Oh dear. Um, we're only 20 minutes in. We can do this. This is why we have so many battle droids. I am still a little concerned. Um, hmm, I should have sent it back earlier, because then I could have escaped with resources or something, I don't know. I guess we're going to find out.
This is gonna be interesting. Where's that attack at again? Are they not showing on the map? Oh no, I was zoomed in. Let's see. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot. Unleash hell. Oh, it's gonna be beautiful. Oh, good hits. Good hits. We do have these guys, but we did take the the manufacturing places for those with us. I think this is a little loud. Apologies if it was really loud on your ends. But from what it looked like on Streamlabs, it was a little loud. <laughs> Just a little, you know. Alright, when is our next volley coming in? 15 seconds. Should probably see about. Oh, here it comes. Good hits. These are the yeah the mammoth worms. These guys suck. I remember they have like a lot of armor or something. I don't know. They just have a lot of HP then I guess. I just remember they were really annoying one time. There was just a bunch of them. Right, our last pepper drone. Nope, we got one more, and then our Lancer, and then... Oh, that's just a cleaning bot. I was like, what the heck? What are you doing? Oh, you're cutting grass. That's fine. These guys are distracting them long enough so we can get our artillery aimed in on them. I should... hold fire on them, though. And be smart about this. This requires a lot more focus than I want to give. Oh, good shot, Lancer! Just nailed that guy. Yeah, charge, Lance gun. Yeah, good shot. You're about to get completely destroyed, though. Let this guy fire. Just because I want to get off a shot for the Lancer dies. While they're all standing still. Ah, uh, he died. There we go, just that they're staggered out a bit. Nice. Yes! That's the way we want it. That's the way we want it. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. All right. Oh, they are fast. But are they fast enough to get the mud monk before they die? I kind of doubt it. All right. We need to set them to hold fire because they're coming into our defenses now. Man, they're so fast. Holy crap. Even on mud, they are kind of fast, but... Yeah, no. <laughs> Against such an epic firing line, I think they're kind of... Yeah, they're, they're, they're not going to live through this. I was actually a little bit legitimately concerned there, because they were really fast, and they're ranged. But it looks like everything's working out. Looks like everyone's okay. And now the slow ones are coming in. Yeah, wow. 
Yeah, those artillery strikes were extremely good, and of course our pepper drones, our poor pepper drones and our replica lancers were instrumental. What are you doing? No. You are a silly sausage. No. You silly sausages. destroy out here we got this guy probably oh wow that wasn't even okay So, orders, finish off, alright, here we go. They are headed to finish off the enemy. That dared. Where are you going? I mean, that's fair. We do need to keep monitoring for threats. Wait, what? We're, oh, you're... You're falling. But I want you to finish off the enemy! You know what, you... Finish off. Oh, that's that's not gonna work. Unfortunate. Well, that was some excitement. Looks like we just got some more rice harvested. That's cool. Right, how are we doing steel down here? Because we definitely need a lot more up there. Oh, already almost at 10,000 again. Heck yeah, let's let's load this up and go. Eighty-five hundred, and we need a lot more plasteel. And of course, I drop it. Thank you. Okay. We're getting things loaded up. Okay, now we're getting them finished off. This is good, this is good. A lot more steel loaded up. <coughs> Excuse me. A lot more steel loaded up before we can launch. Honestly, probably about 8,000 each time would be a good amount to launch with. Because this is what 7,500 did for us last time around, so. Should be good. And then, right, wait, what, what happened here? Why? Why are we out of chem fuel? I'm confused. I, I legitimately don't know. It's fine. Anyway. I was going to put down some hole plating in these areas. And then figure out what I want to do for the heat sink and everything. Because I, I still kind of need to figure out how it all works, to be fair.
And honestly, what I might end up doing is just making a couple of these in here and seeing how that works. That's probably going to be a little cheaty, but I, I, I'm okay with that. <laughs> Six times the speed of small engines, and then these are like two times, right? Double the speed of smaller engines, yeah. So it, one of them would be equal to what we have now, I think. Well, almost. It'd be like slightly underperforming compared to what we have now. So we probably need two uh, uranium engines, nuclear engines, whatever. Oop, transfer pod complete launch zoom in and choose uh, yeah right there's fine okay we have more steel coming up and ultimately i think the uranium will be useful because i think the nuclear engines require yeah those little uh what, what do they end up using i forget what they're called the uranium fuel pods. That's right, that's right, that's right. I still don't know why this is unroofed, and I'm slight concern, but it's fine. I'm half tempted to uninstall these three, see if that might be the case. You know what, let's just uninstall all of these and see if that fixes it. What? He just did nothing, apparently. Okay. that fix it? No. I don't know if they can get on top of the turrets in order to build the roof, if that makes sense. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe let's try uninstalling this again. Just one more chance to see like what's going on, see if we can maybe fix it. I think last time it was because of stuff. Would you just do what I ask you to aim? That's annoying. Yeah, it's still unroofed, and I, I don't know why. Because that's, that. I guess that technically counts as a wall there. So why am I going to have to like mouse over every square just to make sure every square has a roof? I think that's kind of where we're going. Constructed roof. Oh. But those count technically, right? Oh. 
I'm... I remember having this issue when we were building stuff down on the ground. Is it because we don't have... Hang on. There it is. Found it. Okay, we're good. And then... Okay, so for now, forbid those. And then zone. Remove roof area here. Uh, even if you have to uninstall this, that's fine. So I vaguely remember having the same exact issue on the ground. Let's just remove any constructed roofs to not have to worry about it. Then build these. <clears throat> uh, I should probably... Replace everything. Trial and error. Eventually you'll get it figured out. What I like to say... Just have to go through different... What's it called? I, think I was just saying this the other day. I'm screwing it up. Yeah, it's just trial and error, ultimately. Sometimes it takes more than half a dozen tries. <laughs> okay. So it looks like they can walk on tur on top of turrets already placed. That's good to know. Will someone just please... Oh gosh, no. That's not at all what I wanted. Uh, fine. Let's do it, though. Just do it. <clears throat> you know there's other stuff you're working on? Yeah, so it looks like they basically go underneath the turrets, because it looks like the turrets are technically on the roof. That's cool. I like that feature. Plasteel. We already out of plasteel, really? Goodness. Hopefully. Yes, we are making plasteel in bulk. Like someone's already delivering. Yep. And now you can prioritize those. There we go. And it is now indoors. Victory is mine after like 20 minutes. Holy cow. Wait, but, oh, frick. I forgot to frick. I'm annoyed now. A constructed roof will do fine. It's fine. Ugh. As long as it's roofed. 
Are you serious? Are you serious? Like, really? It removed one of the roofs, and now the game's like, nope, it doesn't have a roof. Gosh. I am very annoyed now. Alright, you know what? Remove roof area, like right there. And uninstall this, yes, please. And then also, floors. Remove floor here. I'm gonna I'm gonna trick it. And I hope this works. All right. Those all have whole plate. Please, just somebody. Like you're just standing around, folks. Just somebody do something, please. Will that auto seal it by doing that? No. Hmm. All right, so uninstall this again. Zone. Build roof area. And now it's unroofed one again. What? Maybe this will work. For the tenth time. I don't know if it's actually ten, but it's a lot at this point. Honestly. No, don't... Mm -hmm. I think this is why you're supposed to build a floor only after you've fully bordered it in parts. Okay.
Dang it, this is technically a constructed roof right here. Anything that has a constructed roof, I want the roof removed off of. I think that's what's bugging this out. Saw a constructed roof right there. Okay. Let's try this one last time. Please and thanks. On roof 17. Okay. I... I'm just going to allow this room... Oh, I would have to redo the pole plating in each spot. I'm not doing that. Okay. It's fine. There's probably just one area that's just, like, bugged out for whatever reason. Ultimately, it is fine. Because I, th I think what the hole plating actually does is it builds the whole the bottom hole and the roof at the same time. But I would have to dismantle the entirety of the spinal gun. And I'm not going to do that. Ultimately, all of our colonists can survive in the vacuum. So, not a huge concern. Just annoying. Yeah, let's put like four of those in there. And then... All right, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode, actually. We're almost 50 minutes. Sorry about that whole stuff. It's just when you're working with a mod you haven't worked with in a while, you're going to have some issues. It's fine. Thank you all for joining me. I've been your host, Eli the Fatigue. Don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe. It really does help support the channel, it, and I really do appreciate the support. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.